Hi guys, so as you may have seen all over Instagram and Twitter and about every other social media that I have, I am a bit addicted to the gym at the moment. I seem to go nearly every single day and spend most of my time there rather than doing my uni work. So because of that I kind of needed some new gym clothes. I invested quite a bit of money into some gym stuff so I thought I would show you in a video what I've got. But firstly, I'm going to show you my Fitbit, which is a Fitbit Flex. I've actually got it on my wrist right now. This is what it looks like. Um, but it comes with a bigger attachment too if you've got a bigger wrist. But I've got a really small wrist, so I've got the smallest one on the tightest setting. This is my new baby that I'm going to be reviewing um, over the next couple of weeks after I've tried it out a little bit more. And it's just amazing. It like tells you how many steps you've done, it's just got everything in there, it's really good, I love it so far. So I'm definitely going to review this soon, and these are about £100 if you were thinking of getting one. I'll leave the link below, like they come in loads of colours and stuff, so there's something for everyone. The first place I actually bought gym clothes from was Misguided, who I have bought from their activewear range before and actually done a haul on that previously. But I thought that I would go back and see if they've got any new stock, which luckily they did, because I didn't know if they would have yet or not. Um, so I picked up a few pieces from their new collection, mainly just their smoke uh, printed stuff. So the first thing I got was another sports bra because if you've seen my previous video I rave about these sports bras from Misguided all the time. Um, this one is obviously just smoke print on the back as well. Um, it's got the neoprene front and it's really comfortable. Advising, I would advise you to go for a size lower than you think, so this is a size 6. Um, and this costs £10, which is a really good price for a sports bra, I think. But Misguided do put their stuff into the sale quite a bit, just in case you wanted to spend a little bit less than that. The next thing I got was these leggings, which are in the same print, and these are really high-waisted. Like, I bought these in a 6 because my legs are quite slim, but my waist is a bit bigger. Um, so my waist is an 8, but my legs are a 6, which is really strange. So I picked up the 6, but these are actually really tight and slightly see-through. So I wear these more as like my cardio leggings. But they've just got a mesh panel at the back on the knee, and then they are just obviously smoke print. These are really comfortable to do cardio in, but when I do classes and stuff and I've got to squat and things, like I don't really like wearing them because I don't want you to see my bum. But these were about £14, and this smoke collection is so beautiful. They've also got one that's kind of like marbled. Um, and there's like loads of different collections going on at the moment. They've got really cute gym stuff, so I'd advise you have a look. The next shop that I went to for gym clothes was Boohoo. In my gym, they actually advertise Boohoo's active range on their screens, so I thought I would give it a try and see what's there. Um, and the collections are actually really nice and really cheap. So I picked up this top, which just says, busy getting stronger. It's a muscle vest, which I initially didn't really like but it's quite good for when you're at the gym because obviously you don't want to be wearing anything too tight fitting, you want something loose that's going to let you sweat a bit. Um, and this was only about eight to 10 pounds, I can't remember exactly how much. And they did also have a black um, version too. Okay. And then the next thing that I got was these leggings, which are black with the white detailing on them and they've also got like the mesh kind of panels down each side of the leg. These were only 14 pounds or 12 pounds. Um, I'd actually got these in a size 8 because Boohoo is quite true to size with their gym clothes so I went with what I am anyway rather than going down a size. And then the final place and then the final place that I got gym stuff from was Superdry who have recently released a sports collection that has been seen on the likes of like Kylie Jenner and stuff which I didn't realise till after I got it but that's quite cool that I own the same gym clothes as her I guess. It was gifted to me. I didn't get paid for it or anything, this isn't like a sponsored video, I thought I'd just show you because I actually do really really like their gym clothes. So the first is this pink sports bra, which also comes in, like you can get it in the pink and the navy, or the navy and the pink, or like grey and green, there's like quite a few different colourways. Um, but this is the sports bra, so it's just a really cute pink with the black on the shoulders, and it has a super dry hem, which I'm not sure how well you can see. Inside, if I try and flick it inside out. It's actually got like um, supportive bits for your boobs, if you've got boobs bigger than mine, because you know. This is in a size small, which I'm thinking is like a 6 to 8, because it fits really nicely. And I just quite liked it, I think it's quite nice that it's got the super dry around the hem and stuff. It's just a really cute sports bra, and I don't own a pink one yet, so it's quite nice to have that. And to go with the sports bra, I also got this top, which I got in a medium, but I kind of regret that because it is a tiny bit too big. 
but it's just this one that says super dry sports on it it's navy with the pink writing and it's got these um, reflective strips so you can wear it running and on the back it just looks a bit like this so you've got like the open cutout and then there is like a bit here that's fallen down inside and this one was 29.99 for the gym vest again it comes in different colorways but i just really liked the um navy and pink the next thing i got from them was these leggings which are navy with the pink they've got a little pocket on the back there as you can see so you could put like your ipad or whatever ipad you could put your ipod in there um and they just say super dry in pink down the leg these are just really comfortable. These are the most comfortable gym leggings I own and they're 100% not see-through so you can squat as much as you like and flush your bum as much as you like and you won't see any underwear which is really nice. They fit really well and these are a size small again and I'm like a 6 to 8 so they fit really well. I just am in love with the Superdry Sports range. I think it's just such a good range. Like I think Superdry already do like that active kind of like um, lifestyle-y clothes so for them to bring out a sports range is just perfect because it really fits the brand well and the last thing that i got gym wise was this jacket for running which is actually a bit heavy um, it's just a training jumper which has got a fleecy lining and it's the navy blue with the pink piping and stuff around which is really sweet it's also got to super dry down the arm which i think is really cute and it's just a really nice fleecy lining which is perfect for if you are a runner or you walk to the gym or whatever because it will keep you nice and warm and the jacket costs £64.99 which is a bit more expensive but it's worth it for a training jacket that you know is going to see you through many seasons and fit well with your gym gear and it does also have like the little hole as well so that you can hoop it onto your thumb which means that you can keep the sleeves down to keep you toasty. But that is everything that I got in my gym splurge recently because I did splurge quite a bit on gym stuff. But I hope you enjoyed this video. If you've got any other stores that you think I need to know about for gym clothes, let me know down below and give it a thumbs up and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.